off above the streets and houses, rainbow climbing high. Everyone can see it smiling over the sky. Paint the whole world with a rainbow. <coughs> <coughs> Hello, Bungle. Still not feeling very well. Oh, dear. Well, listen, I'm sure the doctor will be able to give you something to make you better. <coughs> Oh, hello. Poor Bungle. He's not feeling very well today. He's got a, a sore throat. Uh, Geoffrey, when will the doctor be coming? <coughs> well, soon, I hope, Bungle. I'm waiting for him to telephone me. Now, how about some breakfast whilst we're waiting? Some cornflakes? Oh, well, if I soften them with milk, that won't do your throat any harm. Oh, yes, please. But, but what if I want something, Geoffrey? <coughs> it hurts if I call out too loud. Well, look, if you ring this, I'll hear it, and I can come upstairs, can't I? Listen. The telephone, right, Bungle? Jeffrey, Jeffrey, the telephone, the telephone. Quiet, Zippy, quiet. Bungle's trying to rest. Now, who is it on the phone? Who is it, George? It's for Jeffrey. It's for Jeffrey. So it's for me, but who is it? He knows it's for him, but who is it, George? Who is it, please? It's the doctor. It's the doctor. Who? The doctor. This is Proctor. It's the doctor. All right, Zippy, take a message. I'm coming down. You take it easy, Bungle. I'll be back in a moment. <coughs> yes, yes, I tell him, yes, you'll be here in ten minutes. Yes, yes, thank you, thank you. Jeffrey, <laughs> Jeffrey, the doctor will be here in... in Thank you very much, Zippy. Now, I'm just going to get some cornflakes and milk for Bungle's breakfast. Well, Jeffy, Bungle will be all right, won't he? Yes, I think so, George. He's just got a sore throat, that's all. Yes, yes. Oh, dear. What, what, what Jeffy? Well, what's the matter? We've run out of milk, Zippy, and the milkman hasn't been yet, has he? Oh, well, you can't have cornflakes without me. Shh, 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 shh. Zippy, Zippy, listen. Could, could that be the milkman coming now? <laughs> yes, it's the milkman. I heard the bottles going clink and chink and chink. I think Zippy's right. I'll go and have a look. Yes, God. Uh, yeah. Cornflakes. <laughs> oh, I like the sound of cornflakes, mate, coming out of the packet. Listen. <laughs> All crackly and rustly. <laughs> yeah, quite right, Zippy. It was the milkman. Oh, dear, I've made a bit of a mess, haven't you? Sorry, Jeffrey. Oh, never mind. I'll just pour some milk. I'll just take it out for Bungle. Yeah. But, no, but I don't think you'll have to. Sounds as if Bungle's coming down. No, he's not. He's gone past the stairs. Oh, he's gone to the bathroom. Oh, yes. <coughs> Oh, he, he had to go to the lavatory. Oh, he ain't. <laughs> He's going back now, yes, back to the bedroom. <laughs> what, 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 what's that? What's that? That's the bell I gave to Bungle to ring in case he needs anything to save his voice so he doesn't have to shout. Oh, that's a good idea. <laughs> I'll take his cornflakes up to him. That's oh, yes, gone Zippy, Zippy, shall we make a get well card for Bungle? Do you think he'd like it? Oh, yes, yes. Well, we could use a bit of paper out of this scrapbook. Uh, now, you hold it there, George. Right. Oh, tear a seat out there. Oh, oh, that's a funny noise. It sounds like a different sort of bell. Ting, ting, ting. Oh, what's that funny noise downstairs? It sounds like a big bumblebee flying about. <coughs> but I don't think it is. No, I think it's D Zippy pretending to be a racing driver. <coughs> oh, no, it isn't. I know what it is. It's the sound of the vacuum cleaner. Jeffrey must be cleaning the carpet. <coughs> We, 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 we've made a card for Bungle, look. Yeah, yeah, let's, let's take it up to him, yeah. Well, later, Zippy, after the doctor's been. Oh, yeah. 
Well, what's that noise? Well, it sounds like a car driving up, doesn't it? Yes, it does. <laughs> yeah, it is a car. That's a who do you go do do do. Now, perhaps it's the doctor. Yeah. Oh, well, it's certainly somebody for us, isn't it? Are we going to see who it is? Oh, yes. Of course. Okay. One. Good morning, Doctor. Yes, Bungle's upstairs. Come up, please. Oh, yes, it's a doctor. the way, Bungle. That should make you feel a lot better. Now, the doctor said it's nothing to worry about, just a sore throat. You should be fine by tomorrow. Oh, I think I'm a lot better now, Geoffrey. Uh, I won't need the bell to call you anymore. Well, no, you rest your voice, Bungle, until tomorrow. Geoffrey, <laughs> uh, when you're alone and it's quiet, you hear noises you haven't heard before. Mm, that's quite right, Bungle, you do. Well, let's have a listen now, shall we? Let's see what we can hear. I can hear the wind blowing. Yes, rustling all the leaves in the trees. Yes, I like that sound. It, it's all soft and gentle. Oh, oh, what's that noise? Well, what do you think it is? I think it's someone cut cutting the grass with one of those grass cutting things. A lawnmower? Mm. Yes, I think you're right. Uh, it stopped. I wonder why. Oh, I think I know why, Bungle. Listen. Yes, it's raining. That's why it stopped. Oh, thunder. And listen to that rain, Bungle. It's really loud now. I like thunder, Geoffrey.
of the drum, Jeffrey. Yeah. Well, it just shows you, doesn't it? Sometimes you can't always tell what some sounds are. Uh -huh. Well, let's play a little game, shall we? Ooh. Yes. Now, you close your eyes and try to guess what these different sounds are. Ooh, yeah, yeah. Come on, George, close those eyes. Yeah, 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 right. You listening? Here we yeah, go, then. Yeah, yeah. Mm. Well, it's like the sound of little bells. It is all the fairy flying about. Oh, no. no. It was none of those, was it? Look, it was the coins from my pocket. Oh, yes. Right, come on, here's another sound. Close those eyes again. Not peeping, are you? No, no, no. Good. Here we go, then. Listen carefully. Oh, oh, oh that's the door. I mean, someone's come in. Very close, if you're not quite. Because, look, you can open your eyes now. See, it was the cupboard door. Oh, yeah. Our big door makes a much louder noise. Listen. Yeah. Oh, oh, and so oh. does somebody else make a loud noise. I think oh, it's Freddy. Oh, are you all right? Oh, yes, Jeffy, I think so. Sorry. <laughs> Never mind. Hello, Freddy. Oh, hello, Zippy. I came to see how Bungle is. Well, he's a lot better, thank you. He'll be all right by tomorrow. Well, uh, can I go up and see him? Oh, oh yes, yes. Uh, and we could take him our car, couldn't we? Yeah. All right, then. Come on, then. But be very quiet because he's still a little bit poorly. Oh, oh, yes, you uh, Tomorrow we can all go out and play in the garden, Bungle, because the doctor says you'll be much better. Oh, but I'm very tired. I, I wish I could get to sleep. Well, maybe I can help you, Bungle. Oh. Listen. Rock-a-bye, baby, on the treetop. When the wind blows, the cradle will rock. When the bow breaks, the cradle will fall Down will come cradle Baby and all rock a by baby On the treetop When the wind blows The cradle will rock When the bow breaks The cradle will fall Down will come cradle Baby and all. Go to sleep, Jeffrey. Oh, that's lovely. Well, let's leave him in peace, shall we? We're trying to say goodbye to you, but we'll see you soon. I'm sure Bungle will be really well by then. Bye-bye. <laughs>